Just one more quick thing, if I can. I'm, I, I, I want to open up my own coffee shop, which I'm working on, and I hope to open it up in the spring in, in Brooklyn, New York. Um, and to, do, to uh, help this process, I've moved in um, with my family, um, and uh, I'm, I'm doing a good. I'm doing a good. <laughs> I'm doing a good job with that contrast. <laughs> Living with the family. But um, I don't know. Maybe there's some helpful words that you can give me for move out. <laughs> Next, even though I moved in to help save some money, well, in the process, just move out. <laughs> well, look at it this way. The universe knows where you are and what you want and what the path of least resistance is to what you want. You're not on it. And you can tell because you're, there, there's just a constant. In other words, it, if it's a struggle to stay on your high flying disc, you're going about it the hard way. It just, it, this is the thing that we want you to understand. The path of least resistance is a fun path. The path of least resistance feels good. The path of least resistance is clarity. The path of least resistance is ease. It's not banging into something every time you turn the corner. I get it. Yeah. And, and, mm -hmm. and what's the rush? In other words, everything is coming to you. Mm -hmm. Don't put an end date on everything. Just let the universe yield it to you because the path, if the path is a fun path, you don't care how long it takes. Mm -hmm. You see, you only want this to be a short path because you're not having fun living at home. <laughs> That's really worth thinking about. Mm -hmm. But if it's a fun path, then it doesn't, you don't care how long you want, you meander into all of these fun corners and experiences and, and all the data that you're collecting. You see what we're getting yeah. at? Yeah. I do. Really good conversation. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. You look beautiful, by the way. Something fast? 